A book warning children about everyday dangers could be in more and more of Buckinghamshire schools. With backing from the County Council, Watch Out is aimed at children from the ages of 4 to 11 and covers difficult subjects like internet safety and grooming, as well as road safety advice. Now the charity behind it says it hopes every school in the county can have the book. Stuart Timworth reports. Singing about stranger danger at Thomas Hickman Primary School in Aylesbury. Stranger danger! Stranger danger! Just one of a series of messages in a book called Watch Out, a child's guide to danger. This school has bought a copy for every child. The most important thing is that children are aware of them without being scared. What the book does beautifully is it approaches these topics and gives us that, that way in where we can actually get children to, to think about things in a very safe way and we can work with our community to be able to improve the opportunities for these children. It's been designed and produced by charity OKR Kids. A future edition will also include topics such as dangers of young people becoming radicalised. I know it starts in primary school. Now, if we can get into the heads of the young children between the ages of 2 and 11 and make them aware of the dangers, and um, then they stand a better chance of going into secondary schools um, more savvy and more aware of what they may face. The charity is also working on an animated film featuring mascot Coco an app for phones and tablets, and this board game called Mistakes and Ladders. I wouldn't want to be approached by someone um, telling us to come with them. Don't come near them because they might be a bit trouble for you. I sat down with my little brother and I had a chat with him about some of the stuff that was in there. Now Buckinghamshire County Council wants to offer the book to every school in the county to help protect as many children as possible. Stuart Tinworth, BBC South Today. Stoke Mandeville Stadium is to become home to an international archive of the Paralympic movement. Around 200,000